Ah, sorry. Every time. Sorry. The good thing is that this controller, the uh, texture makes it. It all wicks up. sweat. Welcome back to Elden Ring, everybody. I guess so. <laughs> Figure that was a good place to start. You saying also, that it we're, wicks we're, sweat? I, I guess we're just dead ass three episodes in. Now. Yeah. That went by fast, right? That's how fun this game is. That went by really fast. It's just because this. It's just because it's so um. It's just because like we've just been doing prep work this whole time. True. So true. we've just been really like focused on. Okay, we're gonna do this. Then we're gonna do this. Then we're gonna do this. Yeah, I like how like every time we switch, we kind of have our own missions. Yeah. I mean, we're we're still doing like the greater mission of like we're gonna get the hook claws and we're gonna go to Stormvale. Yeah. Now we know how bullshit Margit is because we've played the game, so we're like, let's love yeah. a little bit. And like I said, like we both have our different play styles, and his his play style is mostly focused on banging his ho head against the wall for like three <laughs> hours, and mine is being carried. Hey man, I summon spirits and co-op partners. You're, you're if possible. just giving I just people the extremes here. Yeah. Well, I mean, I also like playing with other people, you know. Well, I just feel like the one of the biggest appeals of the soul is the, of souls is the challenge. And well, I yeah, like I of really, course. I feel like I don't really get that. If like, I'm, like, don't get me wrong. I like I um me. I I try to solo the bosses a few attempts first, but then I'm like, nah. For me, it depends on the fight. Mm -hmm. Um, because one, I I actually don't like. I think I've told you this before. Yeah. Uh, that I don't consider summoning the spirits to be the same thing. Yeah, because they do less damage. Until yeah, and they also them. don't always let you use them. Yeah. Like it also depends on the fight. Yeah. Like, Everjail bosses don't let you use the, uh, spirits. Yeah, and then, then when it's just, like, a mini-boss at the end of a dungeon like this, uh, I don't mind using the spirit. I still rather not summon people, because then I feel they like do a lot they're of too strong. <laughs> and sometimes they just happen to have the laser. Yeah. <laughs> That's a cool laser, though. You gotta hand it to them for adding that into this game. Yeah. I just realized I didn't level up. I should I probably mean, go do that. I mean, finish this dungeon first. I what if I die? True. Ooh, Spooky scary. Okay, probably scary time to go to touch grass. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> God, I can't believe we're just Sorry. one of those YouTubers now who unironically refer to touching grace as touching grass, because a good number of YouTubers probably do that by now. I mean, the game's been out a week. It's just a joke that's easy to make. It's low-hanging fruit. <laughs> it is, exactly. <laughs> uh, like my nuts. You ever... What? <laughs> you ever playing a game like this by yourself, and you just start panicking, so you start saying silly things? Yeah, that's my entire existence of playing this game, dude. Yeah, was, like, well, anyway, I just wanted to share one of the ones that I had when yeah. I was doing one of these, and there was, I was, like, being chased by skeletons, and I was just going, rattle me bones, rattle me bones, <laughs> rattle me bones. Bro, <laughs> were your bones being rattled? Yeah, I'm gonna take out bigger, actually, if that's cool. I mean, we need, we need life. Yeah. Uh, like, I'm level 90-something now, and I still have, like, almost... <laughs> The same amount of life as I did when I started. It's kind of yeah. fucked. That's probably why I keep dying. Wait. Oh, that's just a ghost. Ooh. Yeah, see those those uh, lines that yeah. show up? Those are from the buff. Yeah. So that the buff th lasts a long ass time, then. That's awesome. Yeah. At the most, like, I think it lasts for three minutes. And it, I think it gave me, like, 20 more damage? That's not I don't too, know how much. Bad I don't know how much it was doing before, but I feel like I'm doing, like... Oh, yeah, dude, I'm doing, like, hella damage. You're doing gangbusters? <laughs> Excuse me? You're doing gangbusters damage? Ah! Yeah. I mean, to be fair, I'm also dual wielding. I wasn't dual wielding before. Oh, true. I forgot that that's a thing they brought back from Derek Souls then. I don't know why I made that noise. What, the added damage from dual wielding? Yeah. That was only in Dark Souls 1? I mean, like, up no, until now? but it wasn't nearly as strong in any game except for Dark Souls 1 and this one. And Demon Souls, apparently. Oh, okay, yeah, I mean, that makes sense. But that's my basis on the remake, again. <clears throat> well, not again. When's the, last time, when's the last time you played Dark Souls 1? Dark Souls 1? The last time I played it was actually at the... The Bra House. <laughs> on the Switch. <laughs> the worst way to experience Dark Souls. That's the only way I own Dark Souls now. <laughs> I mean, it's portable, so it it's fun. It's honestly not that bad. Yeah. It actually runs really nicely on handheld. It, the, the weird thing is that it runs badly on uh, dock. Like, there's no frame drops handheld, but there is frame drops dock, and I still don't understand that, that, why. That's so janky to me. 
Yeah. I, also, think, it's, speaking, I, think, speaking I think they of, just optimize it for that. Speaking of optimization, I kind of have to mention this. I find it really funny how, like, a Ubisoft dev, dev got so mad about the optimization of this game. Meanwhile... They were talking about the UX design, and this game's UX design is fucking fantastic. They, they talked about the UX design and the, uh, and the optimization of this game, and I'm like... Bro, well, the have you okay. seen the state of, I can pre of Assassin's Creed games the past if, if it since wasn't, Unity? If it wasn't a fucking Ubisoft developer, then that is a that is a genuine uh, complaint. Yeah, a PC but port. It was a Ubisoft developer, unfortunately. But that being said, I'm so glad I literally have the best version, the best running version of Elden Ring. Yeah, I have it on <laughs> like because like I have it on PC, and I am starting, and I am really far into the game, so I'm starting to like see some of the glaring issues like it's been crashing for me every now and again when i just pause it or when i sit at a grace yeah, torrent nice. like despawns after i mount him so i'm just left floating for a bit until i die <laughs> and uh That's kind of funny it is it, it's really funny and uh, what else is there some stutter in certain areas that granted this is also after it's been patched for that yeah, so, I mean, it's a huge game that's super successful, so I'm sure they're, like, working around the clock yeah. to fix every like, single issue. It's FromSoft, so they're definitely just working around the clock to fix all this shit. Yeah. But I'm just so glad that I'm just like, yeah, the PS5 people are losing their save files, the PC people are people with the FPS shit, uh, yeah. and all can't launch the game, and I'm just sitting here on the Xbox like, cool. <laughs> yeah, you haven't encountered any other problems other I, than the game literally like, the one th out. Yeah, and that's just because I was trying to, like, uh, abuse something that you could do in previous Souls games. So, if anything, that was partially on me. I had a hard time with this boss fight at first. Oh my god, okay. You know, when I did this boss fight, I was doing, like, a third of his health in one attack. So this is actually gonna be hard. Okay. Let's do yeah, this. I had a pretty hard time at first. On, but then I got used to their movesets. That's all about learning. At really. the same time, I also had my sexy greatsword it's so I could backflip when I L2'd. It's bosses like these that made me want to try, like... They're so Dagger build. Oh, true. Like, dual dagger? Yeah. He's, he's got a menacing stance, huh? It's because he's tall, skinny, and walking slowly. Also, but he, he has also... a knife. But what he's also do you have in your hand? Oh, a oh knife! My god. Oh my god. No! He's so fast! I miss my magic. I miss my sexy greatsword. It's okay. We're, we're, built, we're doing a faith build, so that means that we can still get, like, some hella good spells. True. Oh, just let me get behind you! I think you're gonna have to start using jump attacks on this one. Oh, As an right. approach. You, know, you might be right about that. I honestly just forget it's an option. <sighs> Aha. He didn't, he didn't hit me. He didn't. That wasn't... Okay, I, that, I was that holding is it down. pretty slow. I was holding it down. I, I was just wondering if it would heal more if I held it down. Did it? I think slightly. He doesn't get staggered, man. I don't know what to do against him. Maybe just jump attacks. Yeah, because jump attacks have a tendency to stagger, and after, if you do a, a, a bunch of jumping attacks in quick succession, you actually break his posture and can do a critical hit. Mm, no, that's, that, that's why jumping attacks are so useful in this game. That's fair. <clears throat> Look at Mr. Sekiro over here, knowing how to use the jump button. What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> Sekiro didn't even have <laughs> jumping heavy attacks. I'm, I have no idea, man. I just felt like saying that. <laughs> like, that I was just... funny, but I feel kind of wounded now. <laughs> <laughs> like, literally, it was... All of it was a compliment, technically. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I just like, said it in a douchey voice. said it in such a sassy way that it didn't come off as a compliment, and it kind of hurt. <laughs> Tone's crazy, huh? Yeah, I know, right? And it doesn't oh. come off properly in Facebook. Listen, man. <laughs> See? You're Stagger. right. You were right. I get it. You were right. <laughs> no one left. Oh. <laughs> Bro, look at this dude. You can't. It's dark. True! <laughs> I can't wait until we get the hook claws, because then we'll have bleed on top of everything. Oh, true. And bleed is just... A bleed is so bleed disgusting is so in this game. game. In this game, yeah. <laughs> Like, I just have to hit an enemy, like, four to six times with my sexy greatsword, all of a sudden they explode in blood. Oh, uh, I didn't think he would do that. Um, do you think that Miyazaki made uh, uh, Arcane really strong in this game because he has Bloodborne favoritism? 
Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I think so. But, like, Arcane only, like... Arcane apparently only scales off of very specific weapons and spells. And, mm-hmm. like... Arcane is actually a defensive magic spell. Yeah, there, there are apparently, like, very few weapons that scale off of Arcane. Yeah, but Bloody Slash doesn't. Bloody Slash That's goes true. fucking crazy. That's true. Um, is that, it gamer time? Yeah, it is gamer time for you. No, no. Oh, no, it's okay. It was, yeah, it was quiet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Bam! It's gamer time. Am I gonna have to say that every time I get up to do the gamer responsibility now? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's gamer time. Audio Bye. off. Wife beat. No, bro, please. <laughs> Stand up. Oh, yeah. It's gamer time. <sighs> what an oppressed minority. Are we? Oh yeah, we gamers. are. We're gamers, <laughs> dude. We should I, be an infamous. I really want to play. Like, I really want to play Infamous again. You want to talk more about the oppressed gamers and in Infamous? That was just oh, the, good, no, 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 no. That, that was just a good bit. You did it. Nice sound. I don't know. Sorry, I, I kind no, of. No, no, it's fine. It's I fine. I lost you, control you, of you, my you, voice. Dude, you, 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 you got the the message you were trying to get across. And you did it without even saying words. So, you know. I, all I had to do was point and sound like a, like I needed some help. <laughs> ah! Why use many word when few do trick? Or, you know, just say... Da, 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 da. Bam. That's such a cool animation. I know. Like, it didn't sound flashy, but it actually does look pretty flashy. Ah, oh, that bitch. Oh, sexy hitboxes, though. Yeah. Gotta hand it to them. They were, hey. like, really precise with their hitboxes. Yeah. And there's, like, 2,000 souls? I guess we'll see. There's also a chest right there. Also, hello. What'd you get? Again, I'm just, like, searching for future builds. Oh, wait, no, it's, a, it's, a, it's, it's an accessory. What? It's an accessory. It's not... The it's talisman? not a... Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Sure. I love that shit. That, I have that... I've, I've had that shit equipped... Since I started the game. Is, uh, is hitting someone from the back considered a crit? No, a backstab is. Wait, so can you just get crits while you're fighting in general? Just by matching yeah. one? Huh. Yeah. Like, it's yeah, happened it a few times before to me. And, uh, like, as I said, sta- like staggered enemies after you've broken their posture can lead into a critical hit. And that could automatically lead to a heal with this. So, mm. it's, a good, it's also a good way of just saving Crimson Flasks. Sorry, my my brain just got distracted because I thought of yet another build you could do because mm-hmm. I was thinking dual daggers and blood because mm-hmm. that's not a thing you can do. Mm-hmm. Uh, but there was that one boss who has dual daggers and scarlet rot. Oh, I hate that shit. That might be that might be a fun build. <laughs> that, that must be super degenerate in PvP. Too. Oh yeah, dual spears with scarlet rot sounds so toxic. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go to that cave that I was talking about earlier. Uh... What cave? <laughs> yeah. You know? Not really. Okay. What the fuck? Oh. You good? Yeah. I there was, was, just there reading... was a, lot, a lot of stories that just whizzed by really fast. There. It wasn't really a lot of stories. It was one person's story with a lot of. Uh... Oh, just someone who just obsessively posts everything they're doing with their day all the time. No, well, I mean it's a Twitch streamer, so they kind of have to. Oh yeah, that's fair. It's kind of or not that. Twitch streamer, but well, an she influencer. does she does stream, but yeah, she is kind of an influencer. Yeah, well, not fair. kind of. She's just straight up an influencer, I guess. Yeah, there we go. yeah fair enough. It's the voice actress of Jill Valentine from Resident Evil Three Remake. Oh okay, well, like she's well known. Yeah, you could just say that. <laughs> or a celebrity. I don't want to fight that guy. The giant? Yeah, no, thank you. They're surprisingly easy. You just gotta stay between the legs and. St- like, avoid the stomps. That's cool, man. I still don't feel like fighting him. <laughs> oh, fuck it, I wanna get out of the beach! Shh. There was... Uh, what? You gotta, you gotta run past the giant if you wanna get to the beach. Yeah, I'm noticing that. I, 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 I literally just I do, remember that. I never... Another thing I love about this game, mm. um, I never realized how much I needed jumping in a Souls game. And not just in, like, a combat oh, yeah, way, um, you see but that light over in there? a fucking platforming way, mm-hmm. in the, like, design way. What What is this? Um, attack that, and then you'll get something. I forgot what it is you get, but you do get something. If Am I you, supposed like, to follow the path? No, you don't follow the path. You just attack the thing that's creating the path. You, like, you kill it. What is... Oh! 
Yeah, you have to tie I see he's like invisible. Yeah. No, I got I got this. I will just stand right here. <laughs> Gotta time it really well, as I said, because like I, it took me a few tries to do it. But then again, I'm just not as precise as I want to be. Yeah, watch you do it in the first try. I'm gonna, 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 where, where is it? He's coming. He's, oh lord, he's coming. I missed. There we go. How about that? Okay. You know, I'm gonna stand in the same place. Fuck it. Well, why, why risk it? If it ain't broke. Don't tell Carl. Don't tell Carl. Why'd you charge it? I don't, I don't charge it. It'll die in one hit. Okay. I'll just do this. I mean, that, uh, I feel like the spear is more likely to hit. Yeah, because it's very. <laughs> okay. I'm mad. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you gotta time it really <laughs> precisely, as I said. I've never even seen these things in this game. It's a nice little challenge. Maybe now. There we go. Hey, sweep! Sweep. Not bad. Okay, so the, the, that's another way to fa find uh, Ashes of War, then. Yeah, the dung beetles. I hate uh, these things. I fucking hate It's gamer things. time. Oh, yeah. It's gamer time. God damn it. God damn it. I can't believe we actually found a way to implement the phrase it's gamer time into our fucking show. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That's the world we live in, dog. Actually, I think this is where Patches is. It's a gamer It's a gamer world. Hey, Just a gamer monkey. in a gamer world. <laughs> yeah. Oh! Oh! NPC! Yeah, this it's is a shop. This is literally where I was heading, dog. I mean, not just this. I'm also going to the cave, but... I don't want any trouble now. Um, we should get a bow. Why? We're not friends. right. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. No. Never mind. <laughs> okay. No, Where's the cave? This guy. It's actually it's over yeah. Here. It's okay. It's right. It's right by the monkeys, right? I think so, actually. Unless it's past. Yeah. The it's not past. It's right by the monkeys. I meant past the merchant. Also, yeah. This this. No, okay, never mind. I'm full of shit. What? I think this is the Patches Cave. Yeah, I think so too. If not, and then and it's the two demi human chiefs, then I think that's how you get the the first uh, sewing needle. Oh, you know what? You might be right because I, I did this and I was like, oh, that's how you get it. <laughs> Wait, did you do it recently? Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. I, I oh, fucking... that actually explains I, why I, I ex you remembered it. Yeah, no, no. I, that's what I was saying. I was exploring. I was trying to find every cave in Limgrave for this playthrough. Oh, we really need to get a lantern. That works. That helps a little bit. I can't see anything. Okay. I didn't see anything! I didn't see anything! I saw everything. What's that from? Dracula, dead and loving it. There's a boss in this area. Yeah, I know. Hi. Oh my god. I guess they don't do a ton of damage. Yeah, I mean, technically, this is just a mini boss. Oh, I meant his dude bros. He actually does, like, okay damage. You actually find a couple of these guys out in the world once yeah, you get to I've, I've, I've Faria, I guess. Uh, Maybe not really Faria. But, uh. uh okay. Lyurnia, yeah, that's what I mean. <laughs> and, uh, the Weeping Peninsula. I think I can get, take one more shot before I have to go. Oh, we need to get some fucking sacred tears. I think I think I'm gonna die. This is fine. Yeah. Uh, stay in that in that area close to the gate if you don't want to get the enmity of the other chief. Mm, if you don't want to get aggro. Yeah. Ah. Okay. That way you can just beat them one by one. I'm, uh, the episode's actually almost over, so I'm gonna try one more time, and then, right. uh, and then we can wrap it up, dog. Oh right, I was gonna summon the fucking dogs. Wait, you had two turns, right? I kind of want to have another turn after this. What? No, I mean we're not done recording. Oh okay. I meant call. Like, I meant like wrap up this episode. Oh okay. Yeah okay. 
it's actually really cool that the uh, buff effects actually give off light. Yeah, that, that's a like nice. That's a really ability. nice touch. Yeah, I, I'm actually like a little like brighter up now because I have the buff on. Why did not I just lock the arm? It's so stupid. I, actually, yeah, I, I I didn't realize that you weren't locking on until just now. No, like earlier when I couldn't see anything. Oh, that's what you meant. Yeah. I thought you were talking about during the boss fight. No, in the boss fight it was. So, oh, you stopped locking on to get away, I see. Yeah, okay, what, so do I just stand over just here? close to this area, behind this rock and, and around it. Also, these guys are weak oh, to no, fire. Guy. And you can backstab him like this. Where is he? He's behind the rock. There. What? Where is his back? <laughs> I think you're facing it. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Nope. Like, <laughs> you, get, you get what I'm saying? Like, yeah, it was really hard to see what it, where his fucking back was. I aggroed everybody in the room. Just kind of didn't no. Like, you actually have to pass that border in order to get the other guys aggro, I believe. What? Or not. They're on their way here now. Yeah, that's why I was like, yeah, I just aggroed Yeah, that's my here. bad. I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. No, that's my bad. I'm the one who fucked it up. Ah! I feel like this playthrough is the polar opposite of the last Bloodborne session we did. <laughs> oh yeah, I mean, we're both having fun and I'm not giving you shit, so... No, you are, but I'm actually not taking it personally at all. <laughs> well, you're also giving less shit, I guess. Yeah, I mean, as I said, the openness of this game just really helps. Hey! I'm alive. <laughs> hey! I can fly! He can talk?! <sighs> All right. That's right, fool. Anyway, we'll continue our Elden Ring playthrough on the next episode of The Toastman.